yo what's up guys how's it going this is Pryoxis, and i am back with another video in this video right here guys is going to be about submission uh, reversals as well as uh, arm trap submissions if you guys don't know what they are you will learn today <laughs> so uh in order to, to complete these i'm going to show you the three submissions you will need okay if you don't know how to go to submissions if you don't know if you have the submissions i'm sorry you need to click start all right go down to view moves all right Go over to submissions and make sure that your um that red bar at the top is under the fighter that you um that you prefer you want so you need the guillotine choke a kimura and a knee bar and then the last one is a triangle choke now i'm going to get more specific with these whenever i get into the that submission but if you wanted to do everything you need a kimura a knee bar uh triangle choke and then a guillotine and some fighters that have that rafael dos Anjos has it i'm sure um what's his name what's his name brown ortega has it tony ferguson has it but he doesn't have the guillotine he has the uh anaconda choke so i don't know if that'll work but donna cerrone as well i'm sure but i don't think cerrone has a knee bar and i don't think tony ferguson has a knee bar i think ortega is the only one that's like 100 percent sure but I'm not too sure, guys. But we're gonna get into it. So the first one is um, it's a, it's a submission from on the feet, and when they try to shoot a takedown. So in order to perform this, guys, pay attention to the control on the screen. You hit this trigger right here, right? This is left trigger. This is right trigger that's blinking. On PlayStation, that'll be this will be L2, and this will be R2. So hold this trigger, hold this trigger, and you want to hold the right stick down, right? This will perform either the guillotine or the Kimura. Most of the time, it's a Kimura. Um, I know 100% it's a Kimura on a double leg. If they shoot a single leg, sometimes it turns into a guillotine. But it is a two-gate stage submission. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the double leg real quick. Now, have them go, boom. Hold both triggers down. Hold the stick down into a uh, Kimura. Now, I'm going to stand it back up, and I'm going to have him throw the single leg this time. There you go. Now, here's the single leg. Boom, Kimura. Again, sometimes it'll switch from a Kimura to a guillotine. Remember that, guys. So, now we're going to move on to the next one. And for this one, I'm going to plug my controller, my second controller in, so I'll be right back. now we are back so this one right here guys is going to be from postured up okay you want to pay attention to your own character and not the enemies um so when he this is your left side right your left side this is your right side so if you hold rt you'll see on the prompt on the right side blue side that arm trap pop up now if you flick it in time hold rt and flick the right stick in time of that direction you get an arm trap now in order to do the submission for the arm trap, you want to always, you want to hold down left trigger. And you want to always go to the opposite side. So if you caught the, if you caught his arm uh, with your left side, you want to hold LT and hold your stick to the right. Now, if you caught his, let's say you caught his, his, um, you caught it on your right side. Then it'd be just the opposite. Boom, triangle choke. Same thing. So, and we're going to get into the next one, which will be from Stacked Guard. By the way, guys, if you don't get any of this, be sure to rewatch the video or rewind or slow it down. Hopefully, I'm getting, um, I'm helping you guys out with this, and I'm being very, uh, very clear. So, this one is from Stacked Guard. Uh, I had to lab this one a little bit because sometimes it didn't work, and I found out why. So, pay attention to the, uh, the prompt on the right side, RDA. You see that? He threw a punch, right? And nothing popped up with this hand. Now watch what pops up when I throw it with the other hand. Boom. See that arm bar and the uh, triangle choke popped up. So in order to do this, you have to hold down the left trigger, as you see on the controller. And when he throws that hand, you want to hit, you want to flick the um, stick. So boom. Flick it left or right, doesn't matter. I prefer the, uh, the arm bar because it's always a two-gate submission. Even with Conor McGregor, it's a two-gate submission. Again, I want you guys to understand that it is not always going to be that, that hand on the left side. That'll be the submission. Sometimes it switches. 
See, it didn't switch here, but I've I've had uh situations where it switched. But you just you just want to pay attention to the um to the submission, guys. Like I said, maybe you have to take a cup on the chin before you can do it. But you wanna like you wanna hold LT. Remember, if you do this, you are not blocking. So hold LT and see which hand pops up which hand gives you that prompt and it's it's not hard to do this it's like the thing is people think you can do this with each hand but you can only do it with one hand so if he throws this one you're like bro i'm not getting it he's just punching punch me over and over again and it's not working but he can be punched you like this boom and you can get it see very very easy i know guys like bro it's not working and, and it works it's just you you have to uh get the right hand and the last one is going to be a a knee bar. Okay, I do this one a lot on guys that like to do this back sitting transition. So in order to perform this one, guys, remember you need a knee bar. You need a knee bar submission from postured up. Right there. See that knee bar? Left trigger knee bar. Now go go back down. So in order to do this reversal, if just your opponent goes this back sitting, right? Look at the look at the blue pop. See that? See how that knee bar, um, that knee bar pops up? Now, if you have to hold down left trigger, right trigger, and then when he goes for that, you want to flick in the direction of that back sitting. So here it'll be, it'll be uh, to the right. Like it'll just be the opposite of uh, denying that this transition right here. You know that that's denied with the left, and then the other one would be denied with the right. So be holding it down, and you have a lot of time to do this. Be patient. Hold down left trigger, right trigger. As soon as he goes for, it, look, I'll wait to the end. Boom, wait all the way to the end for that. And I still got it. And it's a four gate for RDA as well as a four gate for it. Um, what's his name? Brown Ortega. So uh, I do hope these submissions help you guys out. I really think this is pretty dope, especially that stacked guard one. I think a lot of guys will learn from that one and understand what they're doing wrong and why they're being punched out of, <laughs> punched into freaking oblivion with those punches. And like, bro, I'm not getting enough submission. So. With that being said, guys, uh, I hope you guys are enjoying my channel and are learning. Um, I'm actually getting a lot of positive feedback from you guys, and I really appreciate it. Now, we'll be back with another video, hopefully tomorrow. Maybe some uh, some fighter showcases. I hope you guys are excited for the UFC event coming up this weekend, because I am too. <sighs> be sure to like this video, guys. Comment what you think. And